<laughs> yes, I'm thrilled. <laughs> <laughs> Why wouldn't I be? I just love teasing you because I, I, I miss you. I miss you all. Since you left, we don't talk about sex anymore. I, let's, <laughs> let's talk about sex. Well, yeah, happy we do have a question about sex. Okay. We, oh my we gosh, would, we I'm could, ready. And so oh. <laughs> there was a, a conversation that happened in a magazine, and a, a wonderful lady who we know well, Lisa Ling, said that uh, she was never comfortable having sex with the lights on. We what do you, you should that? weigh in on that. Yeah. <laughs> I where where's the biggest light up here? <laughs> I'm like I like to sh shine that thing. On. No. Uh. <laughs> Is to be lifted up. Yes. Yes. Who oh yeah, that's true. To feel me? I like, remember that. What do you mean? I like that. Yeah. She I loves like lifts. It's her. It, like she Maybe wants you people should to join do the circus. <laughs> it's I her like thing, that, actually. <laughs> but you I don't have to be comfortable so with your body to want to have and you know sex what? I think with the lights I've on. Gotten more comfortable as I've gotten older, and I and I do. Yeah. I feel more confident. So I'm it like. Started as oh, right. Right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It started as a nightlight, and now it's a spotlight. Disco ball. Maturity, Kim. Luckily, my husband has cataracts, so. <laughs> what have you been doing? We know about we know about Fuller House. Fuller House. We've been working on that uh, all year. We just wrapped up. Oh. But I've been a busy bee, so I'm starting my new Christmas movie next week on for Hallmark, and three new Aurora Tea Garden mystery movies. Three? And I, three. And. Uh, She's got and then, and I have a new, a new book coming out in oh. November called Staying Stylish. Oh. So, and then oh, I've got my kids and... Oh. 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 You kind of answered my next question because I know one of the things I think no one could wrap their mind around, but you were commuting for so long with this right. show. Yeah. yeah. And now that you're not, I was going to say, what do you do with your free time? But you still don't I have don't free time. I don't have any free time. <laughs> She's I really don't. This girl. Yeah. The Aurora yeah. movies are great. I like them. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Harris, the woman who wrote yes. the Sick Stack House. Yeah. They're, yeah. They're, yeah, they're wonderful. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. who the. Thank that's you. Who I love that. making them. Has the hubby, has the Russian. The Russian is great. He's really. Val the Impaler, we call him. <laughs> uh, we got to talk about the third season of Fuller House, which is amazing. That starts this week. Now, yeah. for much of the show, for much of the show, your character DJ, who we all know has been in a bit of a love triangle, mm -hmm. oh. yes. with new guy Matt and fan favorite Steve. I love Steve personally. Just saying, I'm on Steve. Your team I'm Steve. on Team Steve. Team Steve. Okay. Uh, we love your husband Val. What does Val think about these storylines when you're in these love triangles? And yeah. Does he does he take well, it well? I think I think Val wishes I was back at this table because yeah. he loved watching me on the View because I was myself. Oh. And you didn't yeah. have to kiss anyone. I didn't have to kiss anyone. Yeah. Only when Joy tried to force me to kiss her. <laughs> Woo! Whoa! You got me. Joy kisses a lot. Paula, you know. I'm very affectionate. Oh, she kisses a lot. Yeah, a lot that's why I sit over here. <laughs> With anybody. <laughs> she would right right just lean over and. You <laughs> say you're not special. No, you are special. You're you the are. first really religious person I've ever kissed. <laughs> First. I'm afraid that's true, actually. Uh, you're going to stick around, and the cast of Fuller House joins us next. Yay! 